In this video, I'll be using group policy to disable ad privacy features in Google Chrome. I'm starting this video from my GitHub page and that's because there are a few bits of information here that I will be using for this video. And I will leave the URL in the description down below. Also in the bottom of the page, you can find more of my videos that are related to this topic. For example, here you can find videos about my Windows Server setup. And there is also a video about installing policy templates for managing Google Chrome settings via group policy. And here you can see the objective for this video. First, I will be disabling the ad privacy feature message that you see in the screenshot right here. And then I will be disabling all the features. So it's add measurement, add topics, and also site suggested ads. And here you can also find the list of the policy settings that I will be configuring in this video. And now I will begin this video by going to my November workstation where I have my Windows environment. And here I will be creating my group policy. So I'll go to tools, group policy management. I will right click on group policy objects and select new. I will name the policy Chrome settings. Then I will click on OK. I will expand group policy objects. I will select the policy that I created. Then I will right click on it and select edit. And because I will be configuring this policy for my computer, so I will go to computer configuration, policies, administrative templates, Google, and then Google Chrome. And somewhere here we should see privacy sandbox policy. I will click here. And here we have all the settings that we need to configure. So first I will be disabling the message itself and this is the policy for that. Sandbox prompt can be shown to your users. I will click on it. I will disable this policy. Click apply and OK. Now I will do the same for all the three other policies. So first I suggested ads. I will click on it. Disable it. Apply and OK. Now for the ad topics. Disable. Apply and OK. And now for the ad measurement, disable, apply, and OK. So now I have all the four policies here disabled. And that's basically it for this group policy. I will close the window right here, go to details, and for GPO status, I will select user configuration settings disabled because currently this policy has only computer settings in it. And I will leave all other settings on default. Now, after creating my policy, I need to assign it to an organization unit. That is holding the computers on which I want to deploy the settings. In my case, the organization unit will be this one. It's called computers and it is holding all the computers in my domain. So to assign the policy, I will click and hold on the policy and then drag and drop it on the organization unit right here. Then I will click OK. And as you can see, the policy settings appeared here and also in the list here. And that's basically it. Now to test this policy, I have two client machines here. Both of them have Google Chrome installed, but both of them never executed Google Chrome. And that means that we should get the pop-up for ad privacy message. And because I didn't give enough time for my client machines to update group policy, we should see the message for the ad privacy message. And after that, I will show how it looks after group policy update on this machine right here. I'll go to my client 01, I will open Chrome. We should get the first run wizard. Let's not sign in, let's skip. And as you can see, we didn't get, get the ad privacy message and that's because it pops up on the second run. If I close Chrome and reopen it. And here we have the turn on ad privacy features. I will click on no thanks here. We get another message and got it. Also, if I go to settings here, then let's go to privacy and security, ad privacy. Here we have the add topics, suggested size, as you can see, is enabled by default. And same goes for add measurement. So this is how it looks by default without the settings. And now let's go to my client 02. And before running Google Chrome here, I will go to my start menu, search for CMD. I will enter GP update, press enter, and now let's wait a bit. And as you can see, the policy update was successful. If I minimize my CMD window and open Google Chrome, we still should get the first turn wizard. Let's not sign in, skip, and let's close it and reopen it. And as you can see, this time I didn't get the ad privacy message here. Also, if I go to settings, and where is it? It's here. And go to privacy and security. Add privacy, add topics is disabled and I can't even enable it. And now for suggested sites, we have it disabled also. And same goes for add measurement. And that means that the policy is working fine. 
And that's basically it for this video. Like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And see you in the next one.